Hello, I'm Divyasi Sivachandran from SK Sinanya. Don't judge a book by its cover or in this case its size and condition. It may look small and old but I personally enjoyed reading it. It's published by Playmore Publisher and it has 238 pages. It's a good read that inspires one to look at life positively. David Copperfield comes highly recommended as this book is an adapted version for young readers like us. The author of the book is Charles Dickens who was an English writer and social critic. During his time, he created some of the world's best known fictional characters and regarded as the greatest novelist of the Victorian era. Some of his other works include A Christmas Carol and Oliver Twist. David Copperfield was also made into a movie in 1935, which goes on to prove the strength of the storyline. Come with me as I narrate the story briefly. David Copperfield's father dies before his birth. He finds love in his mother and their housekeeper, Miss Peggy. Then his mother remarries Mr. Mudstone and wicked man. He always beats David for no reason and he controls the family. The world comes crashing down when his mother dies. He is sent to work in a bottling plant where he undergoes a, a lot of hardship. He runs away to stay with his aunt, Betsy Trotwood, the only relation he had. She disliked him at the time of his birth. Do you know why? Read this book to find out for yourselves as we read we discover that people may change and be unexpectedly wonderful. It is very true in the case of Miss Trotwood. She plays a vital role in David's life when he needed her the most. I guess this God's way of letting us know that we are never alone. He meets some interesting characters along the way and discover true friendship in Agnes, when he moves in with Mr. Wickfield, among Wickfield's border is Uriah Heep, a snake-like young man. He turns out to be the villain who throughout the story maintains a false modesty and causes um, the, people trust who, the people who trust him. Next comes Dora Spenlow, a beautiful lady whom David falls in love with and gets married. After some time, he realizes she is so childlike and cannot run the household. Despite that, David, can, David continues to love her. Tragedy strikes again as Dora falls sick, as Dora falls sick and dies. Heartbroken, he travels abroad. What happened next? If you are eager to find out if he have ever if he ever finds happiness, why wait? Start to reading this book now. You will, be, you will not be disappointed as this story is loaded with a lot of values that I feel can, I really, can, really, can relate to us. It teaches us not to give up easily in life. David stays strong and refuses to be beaten. The moral lesson that David Copperfield could be said in part that kindness, sympathy and generosity more important than wealth, power and social position. Through his writing, Charles Dickens has brought the characters and story alive. I am determined to face the challenges in life after reading this inspiring story. Thank you.